couple of years back, I did somehow befriend Steve Malbronk. He got me into see Spurs quite a few times, and then I got him a ticket for the Brit Awards in exchange. You know, if any of the Spurs players wanted anything related to the band, I would, I would, in a flash, they could, I would give it them, of course. I was there this morning at the White Hart Lane doing some an interview for the magazine, but yeah, yeah, I walked past the CD player and I was thinking, come on, let's try and infiltrate these footballing minds who are just stuck in their urban, you know, hip hop ways. They need to be indie alternative guitar music, whatever, needs to penetrate that, that dressing room, you know, up and down the country, I mean, as well. Not really. I don't. I don't really hate Chelsea either. I don't really hate. I don't really hate football teams really. And she was seemed pretty cool, you know. She was actually kind of. Uh, she was into us, you know. <clears throat> and us and a few other bands played, and and I didn't get to see Roman, but apparently he was lurking somewhere backstage area, kind of ish with his Roman, uh, his Russian friends. No. no. <laughs> <laughs> No fee, you know, you do anything for Harry Redknapp. I think I'd be more starstruck meeting Harry Redknapp than anyone, anyone from any field of, of uh, yeah, from any field, you know. I mean, I, I, I just think Harry is, is, is a hero, you know. What he did, you know, what he has done in the last two years for Spurs, just transformed him and he looks like a, the way he comes across in interviews and stuff, he just looks like a, just a proper dude. A Brit would be obviously very nice, you know, wouldn't say no to a Brit, but um, definitely would not say no to a Spurs, Spurs League. League and Champions League, now that would be it, you know, that would be the dream. You can't, no, it doesn't, no amount of money would, look, 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 Spurs, okay? No, no. Footballing music in general, you know, New Order, um, you know, Three Lions. Apart from that, not much works, does it really? You've got to take football songs with a pinch of salt and ingest, and they've got to be fun and you know, kind of almost terrace, terracy, you know, not serious. I'm not bothered, you know. I really don't care. Like he's, he's not brilliant. <laughs> I mean, you know what I mean? Like, I've got better things to really worry about than Soul Campbell. Doesn't, doesn't bother. We've got Lady King, it's much better. Well, rock and roll bottom. Drugs. Sex. Football. It's pretty good.